Hello, my name is Nicole from TheLadyPreferstoSave.com and today I am bringing you another awesome collab, this time my favorite YouTubers of 2017. So if you'd like to see who I have been loving this past year, stay tuned. As this is a collab, do keep in mind that I will list in the description bar below the playlist so that you can check out all the awesome people who are part of this collab and be sure after watching this video to check them all out as well. And let's get started. Okay everyone, I am actually looking through my subscription tab for my YouTube account. So if you see me kind of looking over, that's what's going on. And so, let's see here. The first of my favorite, favorite YouTubers from this past year was Madeline Olivia. I love her. She is just so fun. She is a minimalist. She's a vegan. She is big into natural skincare, and her channel has been a great inspiration into all things living new, living millennial, living a better life. She also has a channel with her boyfriend, Alex, and their vlog channel has found them this year all over Southeast Asia, as well as moving back to the UK to Brighton, and I just really, really enjoy her channel. She has really fun, simple, affordable vegan recipes. She has a lot of great decluttering tips, and a lot of her blogs are just very personal, very interesting, and so she is one of my favorite channels. Another one of my favorite YouTubers is Darcy Isabella. She is a mother of 10. She is a minimalist. She is an urban homesteader, and she just is amazing. She spends her time not only taking care of her family, but building furniture, creating blueprints for projects, DIY beauty care. She builds desks and bookshelves and redecorates and homeschools her children and teaches them Italian and she is absolutely phenomenal. She's also really interesting in that she does a lot of one ingredient grocery hauls. So if you are looking for new ways to nourish your body on a budget, that is definitely the channel for you. Another one of my favorite YouTubers is Catherine from Do It On A Dime. She is amazing, especially her Dollar Tree hauls. She is able to take the cheapest of materials and turn them into really nice, classy, organized projects. She is constantly redoing everything from hall closets to pantries to her children's playroom to mantles and reeds for each season, and her channel always has something new each week, and I really enjoy watching it. Also, if you are a big bibliophile like I am, you will love Eric Carl Anderson's channel. He is all about the newest book reviews and what you should read for each season and each month, and he breaks them down into weekly, monthly, and seasonal book lists. And so if you want to know what is up in the 411 without even having to check on Amazon or the bestsellers list in your area, definitely check out his channel. Let's see. I also love exploring alternatives, and I don't know if you've ever seen this channel, but it's all about tiny living, unconventional homes, people who live in RVs, people who have made the conscious decision to live outside of the norm of suburbia, and you will see some really, really interesting, interesting floor plans for people's houses. And what I love most about the channel is that you can look inside these really tiny structures and see how people decorate and minimize clutter and maintain their kitchens and have these full, vibrant lives on spaces that are often less than 400 square feet. So if you're into that kind of sustainability like I am, definitely check out that channel. Also wanted to mention my friend Jen from Family and Financial Success. She is a financial planner. She is a mother of two. She's been married for many years. She is a successful blogger. She is also a, um, an accountant. She is big on budgeting and all things debt-free. She has a series on her channel about planning that's not to be missed, and she also has great advice on topics such as why you should have a cash envelope system at home, how to donate to people during the holiday season, and her channel is really, really great. And so there's a little bit of everything on her channel and she is just such an upbeat, 
perky person and she is just an inspiration and if you haven't checked out her channel you will definitely enjoy it. I also love Kim from Free to Frugal. She is constantly coming out with awesome, awesome new recipes and her weekly $25 fresh and ready grocery budget is something that you want to check out every Monday. It's really great just to see what you can get on a budget and eat better and her videos are like talking to a friend and so you should definitely check her out. I also love Samantha from Happily a Housewife. She has some really, really awesome planning videos and cleaning with me videos. And I have over the past half of this year really enjoyed getting back into her channel. And so she is a mom of three little ones and she has a lot of great content that you really, really want to check out. I also love High Carb Hannah. She is a plant-based um, YouTuber. She is also someone who lives in a tiny house. She is just awesome. She does a lot of pantry tours and recipes and a lot of her content is very obtainable. Her recipes are very simple to follow. They're not convoluted with a bunch of crazy ingredients and so I really enjoy hearing her journey of losing weight and coming into her own on a budget in a small space. It's really inspiring and I, I just love it. One of my absolute favorite, favorite YouTubers of 2017 is Jenny Mustard. She is a lifestyle blogger. She is also uh, plant-based. She is a minimalist and she travels the world. Currently, she is living in Berlin with her partner, David Mustard, and they also have a channel together as well as a podcast and she is just absolutely funny. They are a Swedish couple and they do a lot of posting about things like Cuba and um, Swedish living and modern architecture and fashion and all of her recipes which are plant-based are uber delicious and really simple to make and listening to the two of them together it's a great dynamic. It's just relaxing. Again, it's like speaking to family or friends and you'd really, really love their channel. I also, speaking of plant-based bloggers, I love Kate Flowers. She is absolutely incredible. She is a dancer. She is in the Ohio area, I believe. And she has a lot of inspiration and creativity and activism in her channel. A lot of what I eat in a day videos. And if you are into a plant-based lifestyle, definitely check out her channel. Really, really cool. I also love Linda from Linda's Pantry. She is amazing. A lot of canning recipes, home sitting recipes, gardening advice, as well as a lot of uh, plan ahead meals and freezer meals and things of that sort. So if you are into meal planning and meal prepping and gardening, you need to check out her channel. Every season there's constantly new footage being released and she is amazing. She also does solar oven cooking and so that's something I really enjoy is the sustainability of a woman who lives in the burbs. She lives right where everybody else does in a modern community and she does some of the coolest, neatest things with food that you have ever seen and so definitely check out her channel. I also have been really enjoying Lucky Chops. It is an instrumental group and they have a YouTube page and definitely check them out. They have a cover of Adele's Hello that is not to be missed. Love a lot of their music where they shoot videos in subways and so they upload usually twice a month on Tuesdays I believe. Definitely check them out. Another one of my favorite, favorite YouTubers of this past year is Christopher Allen. He is absolutely amazing. His channel is a little bit of cooking, a little bit of luxury, and a little bit of vlogging. And he is just, or seems to come across the screen as one of the nicest people in the world. And his personal motto is spreading kindness and empathy towards other people. His channel is amazing. If you wanna know about the newest small appliance, or you wanna know about what a proper, wonderful GLBT couple is. His is the channel to watch. He is just a breath of fresh air. If you haven't seen his channel, definitely check it out. He is just one of the best and I really, really enjoy 
everything he puts out. Another one of my favorite YouTubers is Melissa Maker from Clean My Space. She is my go-to when I want to hear about cleaning or the proper way to keep order in my house or just the newest gadgets for things around the house. Love her. She's so funny and personal and her channel is awesome for all things, including DIY cleaners, which are some of my favorites. I also love Cass from Clutterbug. She is just hilarious. I love the end of her YouTube videos where she talks about things that have gone on in her life, great, bad, or indifferent. She's just funny and great at organizing and cooking and all kind of really fun things. She's a Canadian YouTuber and her channel is just very uplifting, very personal, very family oriented. And so I have loved everything that she's produced this year. I also love Amber from The Fairly Local Vegan. She is so funny. She's a mom of two. She's expecting her third. She is a heavily tattooed plant-based vegan. She is an Etsy shop owner. She has a little bit of everything from minimalism to plant-based living to homeschooling to unschooling videos. She has a little bit of everything that you could imagine. She's a Canadian vlogger and her channel is just very upbeat, very interesting, and there's always some new content. And so if you are looking for a family that's both conventional and a little bit alternative, definitely check out Amber at The Fairly Local Vegan. Her channel's great. I also love, love, love The Happy Pair. If you're not familiar with their cookbook series and their blog, uh, you definitely, definitely, definitely need to check out this plant based identical twin duo. They are awesome. These two brothers have like the best recipes and over vlogmas, they put out a recipe a day that were just amazing, amazing desserts and really check out their channel. There will be something you want to make there. I also love Melissa from the House of Plaid Fuzz. She has just the best personality and disposition. Her channel is just very upbeat and lively. I love a lot of her room tours. She has an amazing blog as well, and all that information is linked in her channel. And she is, you know, typical, typical kid of the 90s. And as a woman and as a blogger, she's just an awesome person, and I definitely recommend her channel. Really cute, especially if you're into planning, definitely check out her channel. I also love Sean Cannell from Think Media. If you are looking for new ways to up your channel game, if you're looking for better ways to vlog or live stream, or you need to know which camera to buy, definitely check out Sean's channel. He is always coming up with new ways for you to save money and to increase your presence online. And the best part is he has classes and a blog and other things that you can look into as well. He's always has some great tips available and he uploads several times a week and his channel shouldn't be missed. And of course, last but not least, one of my absolute favorite channels of this past year has been the Will and Grace channel. As you know, one of my shows, my jam, is back on NBC on Thursday nights. And so on Tuesdays each week, and again, on Saturday morning, they upload little skits and little mini vignettes from the cast. And so if you are a fan of Will and Grace, you got to check them out on YouTube and see what they are uploading these days. So everyone, those are my favorite YouTubers and YouTube channels over this past year. Again, please check the playlist where I will list all of the channels and as well as the playlist for the other people in this collab. Be sure to check everything out and see if there are some new channels that you might be interested in as well. As always, I want to leave you with this. Please be kind to yourself and to others and have a wonderful rest of your day and a wonderful new year to come. Thank you for watching.